Earlier today, I created a video about how you can connect to OpenAI's Vision API using Typebot via Active Pieces. But it turns out that you don't even need Active Pieces to make that happen. A special thanks to Adam for pointing that out. He says that he was able to create the API connection directly from Typebot. So I had a second look at the API docs in OpenAI and put it together. So in this video, what I'd like to do is just quickly go over how to set that up in Typebot. So first off, you need to head over to OpenAI, go to their documentation, head over to Vision, and then under Quick Start, you'll see this code example that you can replicate for your Typebot. So next, what you'll do is head over to your Typebot and then start plugging in your information. So you'll put in the API base URL up here and then put in your headers, which involves the content type and then your API key that goes in here. And then you're just going to copy and paste the JSON. Make sure that your JSON is formatted correctly. Otherwise, you're going to get an error. And then you'll put your body in here, along with some test variables and test values so that you can make sure everything works OK. So you can see that I've put in a sample user question and my image down here. And then when I tested the request, you can see that it gave me a successful a response of 200 along with the other information here. And then finally, what you want to do is save this content or this response as a variable. So you'll select this here, message content and then set it as a variable. In my case, I'm gonna call it assistant answer. All right, that's it. I'm gonna skip going through the flow. I just wanted to make this quick video as an update to avoid the middleman. In other words, this could be active pieces like you saw in my previous video. This could be Zapier and so on, perhaps make, uh, but it's always nice to not have to use a, a middle software or a middle tool to make things work. All right, thanks again, Adam, for pointing that out. I really appreciate your comment and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video.